Good day and welcome to another MECAD Minute. My name is Dion Legrancy and today we will be looking into part changes. When can we simply create a new revision or when is it necessary to create a new part number entirely? Simply creating a new revision of a part is of course quicker and cheaper. However, before we make changes to a model, we will need to ask ourselves the question. Will a new revision be interchangeable with all previous revisions of the same part? If the answer to this question is yes, go ahead and create a new revision. If the answer is no, then a completely new part with a new part number needs to be created. Answering this question is not always as easy and straightforward as it might seem. For this reason, we use the form, fit and function criteria. Let's have a closer look into the meaning of each of these terms. Form has got to do with the shape, size, external dimensions, mass and sometimes even the color, finish and center of mass of a model. Quite often these factors are recognized easily by just looking at a model. As an example, have a look at the pulleys shown in the image. It is quite obvious that they differ significantly in terms of diameter, width and the number of grooves. For this reason these parts are not interchangeable and they will have to be created using individual part numbers. Fit refers to the interaction with other components. Does the changes affect the mates with other components in assemblies? Does the changes introduce any interferences or obstructions? Were there any changes made to the thread types and tolerances used? As an example, see the left hand and right hand versions of a helical bevel gear shown below. Although these two versions have the exact same external dimensions and almost the exact same features, the two versions are not interchangeable as this will introduce interferences with the mating gears in an assembly. Function involves the understanding of the mechanical, thermal, electrical, flow, acoustic or chemical properties of a component to name but a few. What effect does the component have on its surroundings? It is typical for components to have a similar form and fit but a completely different function. Examples include these springs with different stiffnesses, boiler elements with a different power rating, and these screen filters that allows a different flow rate. Now that we have a better understanding of the form, fit and function of a model, we will be able to answer the question, will a new revision be interchangeable with all previous revisions of the same part? If our revision management is done correctly, we can be sure that we will only ever need the latest revision of a part for the creation of new and spare parts. SolidWorks PDM Professional provides excellent file management capabilities to facilitate revision changes and part number creation. Be sure to check out this fantastic tool.